not paying 60 bucks for it. It's my first time seeing these. Oh, yeah? I've never seen them before. Of course, there's vendors with pops. Man, they need the wall. That's awesome. Look at these autographs, too. Wow. Um, yes, I've already selected two. So. Oh, nice. There you go. And like the Kickstarter will have like exclusive pricing. So you're all, you're gonna get the, the best pricing there outside of the Kickstarter. Yeah, he really set up, didn't he? And it depends on the price. Look, man. And Marvel Light. The more you get, the more this one get. Cable. Machine. Magneto. And there's Spider Shot. Yeah. Of course, still looking for Sabine Wren. We need that Sabine. And it seems like no one's no one's got her. Two bucks. Eye of Agamotto. Accessory, look at that. Ten. So I was looking out for an X-Men 97 Rogue because oh, nice. it's crazy. I passed on her like twice months ago because yeah. I'm like, oh, it's fine. Yeah, I can fine. Yeah, then now I'm like, what the hell? Now, right. Even before the show started, right. I was like, where the hell did she go? I can't find her anymore. <laughs> Absolutely yeah. awesome. I just hope it keeps going, right? In that same way because sometimes I get nervous that like, Maybe the first two episodes are like throw everything in there. Wow, so much. Look at that.
sweet. There's a nice little set. There's that rope. It's the old Toy Biz version. I had this one. I didn't even see it. It was the same Where was guy it? from last, last time I was here. Oh, was really? Like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Look at that. That was... That's right. I will use it everywhere I go. Oh. 10, 10, 20. Very cool. Cards too. 40 here, 30. Okay, so we don't see any of the newer ones, but it's still cool to see. Where's that? <laughs> Look at this. There's no war. Even. Four horsemen table. It's always awesome to see sh this stuff. Oh my god. South Plainfield. Interesting. There's the new Assassin's Creed NECA figures. Saw these at New York Comic Con. Very cool. And they have this one. But not any of the other Holothon stuff. Unless I missed it. But I'll look around. And honestly, there's nothing here. There, it's like completely empty. You know what's even worse? There's your Marvel Legends. 
G.I. Joe is Copperhead and Vipra. The black suit animated Superman. Oh, they got Mutt and Junkyard. And then Transformers is not, yeah. Wow. Crazy. So I'm still in Jersey on my way back home, of course. Uh, but uh, I haven't been in this Walmart in a very long time. Probably last time was when I was in New York or something. So let's take a look, see what's here. Let's see. Free pack. Nothing new, okay. All right, where's our main aisle? Let's see what could be here. Oh, Executioner, nice. Definitely good to have an extra one of those, but I don't think I will need to pick one up at the moment. Wow, is Jessica Drew still here? That's crazy. Uh, is that a, oh my God, look at that. Jimmy Woo's here. Oh, good lord. Miles Morales. Hey, there's a Magneto. Nice. We got some more X-Men 97. Nice to see a store that's kind of has stock and new stock as well. Uh, $13. Well, I mean, these are old, very older figures. Oh, wow. Look at that. We got some more of the Mr. Freeze build a figure or collect and connect or collect to build I should say Ooh. invisible jet uh, tie fighters uh, am I going to be lucky is there an Ahsoka here there is not an Ahsoka here there's two Hera Syndulas and two Ezra's. Not Ahsoka, I'm sorry. I'm looking for Sabine. No Sabine here. This Ortiz? Wow. Britt Baker? Wow, that's old too. Stu Grayson is old. Oh my God. Okay. No luck for what I'm actually looking for. They got Baroness still here. Wow. Lady J, we've seen at our hometown. $16 for Retro Destro, 22 Retro Crimson Guard. Do they still have a scrap iron? No, but they have a Snake Eyes and Timber. I guess that could be it. What's up, guys? How's it going? Thanks for watching the video. ToyCon New Jersey, a lot of fun. It was very sporadic the way I was just filming. I didn't really have rhyme or reason. Plus I think I lost some footage, which sucks because I knew I had some extra stuff that I'm like, where, where did all this footage go? I'm like, I knew I recorded here and there and apparently I didn't. Um, a lot of it was just me checking out the tables, seeing some cool stuff. Hoping to find certain things, for example, the Star Wars Black Series Sabine Wren from the Ahsoka series, as well as finding the X-Men 97 Rogue, which we did find. It was right in the beginning of the, of the, of the video, but not for 60 bucks. No way, not, not getting that for 60 bucks. Um, it is definitely harder to find. For, for some reason, Sabine Wren is harder to find too. And I was hoping to find, you know, there was, there was one table where it was, if you buy five, Marvel Legends, Star Wars Black Series, G.I. Joe. If you buy five, it would be like, or buy four, get one free. I think it was. Yeah, if you bought four, you get one free. So you could get like five figures, 20 bucks each, which isn't a bad deal, right? So one table actually had like a lot of the the void Build-A-Figure figures. And I was like, oh, this, this is perfect. I could buy all of them. All And I was missing one. So there was four Marvel Knights figures and I just needed one more. And I was like, they didn't have any more of the Marvel Legends. So I was like, oh, Black Series. Did you have Sabrina Ren? No. I was like, nope, forget it. I'm not going to buy it. So, so I passed. What did I get at the show? What did I buy at the show? I didn't buy anything. 
which is crazy. I did not buy a single thing. I, you know what? Scratch that. No, no, no. Scratch that. I did. Where, where did I put it? Okay. I got it right here. I, I did buy some. I bought stuff from the Four Horsemen table. I bought actually three things for unboxing art, uh, which I shipped it out. He should have already had it. I, maybe he, I think, I haven't checked it. Sorry. I, um... He should have opened up on his live stream. So if you checked out his live stream, by all means, you should have seen it. But I did buy something, but I didn't. I, I was afraid it was going to sell out. So I had uh, Damien from D Blake Makes pick it up early and he picked it up for me. So this was technically what I bought. I bought my Mythic Legions Poxis Horse Flogus. Flogi Flogius. Flogius right there. Uh, yeah, I needed I need the horse. Because this was sold out at Zolocon, and I know they're going to be at the table. So they had it perfect. Thank you to Damien. I appreciate it for picking this up for me. Just in case they sell out, it was it was worrisome. I didn't know, but that's awesome. Very cool. This goes with this guy right here. So now that there's three horsemen, three already. Perfect. And Dre Tree found me, and of course. Um, we had a good time walking around, checking out all the booths. It's a lot of cool stuff, of course. Uh, but he did, you know, he gave me a couple things, which is really cool of him. He gave me uh, this little, little piece right here. This may not be of anything to you guys, but it can be of some to some people. This is a neck cover uh, to... To... <laughs> Our green goblin here so this can get covered up just like so that way you won't really have an exposed neck like it should be um i i have his regular head right here so at the moment that is what it's at i i had the mask somewhere i think it could be up on my shelf but that's just to show you i mean that's cool that he made he, he 3D printed this, so he made a little neck cover for it. So that's awesome to have. Um, he also made some... God damn it. <laughs> he also made some Loki helmets right here. Very nice, right? There's a smaller one and a larger one. Reason being, I, I'm going to try and find a smaller reptile. or But we can use little... Look at that. See, we could use this for the time being. Um, get some tack on there. Make make a little Loki right there. That's pretty cool. And the final thing he made right here. He made Miss Minutes. Look at that. He already put some sticky tack on her feet. But that is awesome. God, NG Trey, thank you so much. This is cool as hell. I'm going to have this exactly where my Loki characters are, my Loki figures. Uh, just, there's going to be some cool pictures with this. This is really cool. And at the show, Disavowed was there. Tim, very awesome to see you again. Um, I hope you had a good time. Uh, this, he did pick up for me. He found this at his Ollie's. My Ollie still hasn't had any of these, but he did pick this one up. Look at that, $3.99. I, he got me two, and Tim, um, Tim, well, the, our toy mayor, Toy Chase, he wanted one as well. So I, I offered him my second one to him because I knew he would have liked it. So he got, he got one. So here's my one, but this is awesome. Three ninety nine, guys. Three ninety nine for a net. That's. That's awesome. I, I'm going to try this out. I know there's like three different accessories and stuff like that, but that's that's pretty cool. Guys, I hope you were able to get this. Even if you didn't have starting lineup figures, you can use this for your legend stuff. Make some fun pictures. This is awesome. And some mail. Mail is important now. So mail, this is a pre-order that I had through Mallfish Collectibles. And Mallfish Collectibles... Um, very popular with our Mythic Legions. So these are two Mythic Legions that were on pre-order sometime last year. Uh, but these are retailer exclusives. So the first one was a Blue Hagnon 
Look at that translucency. That's awesome. Very cool. I think I have the original Hagnon, which is like a white, a white color. But this, this is nice. That's very cool. Blue Hagnon right there. And the second, the second one, I think is so cool. So much better. We got Lije right here. Look at that. Asian dude, look at that. <laughs> um, but he has a like an orc head. Um, but he's, he's like a regular size. I think it's like a, um, a, a 1.0 body. But Lee J of the Elite Elven Guard. So he is an elf, right? Uh, but not only that, he has some parts in here that you can just swap out and interchange the arms and the legs. So there's a lot of stuff you can do with this. This is very, very cool. And I'm glad I was able to pick this one up. It's gold armor and everything. It'll go great, really great with the rest of the Mythic Legions I've been collecting. And the last, the last male. This, because I couldn't find it. This was through Mercari and it came very, very quickly. It's like the next day I got it. So um, this is awesome because I definitely need it. Absolutely need this figure. Uh, this was for Sabine Wren. So there it is. Got Sabine Wren through Mercari at a great price. Good price. 20 bucks. It's not bad. I mean, hell, it's all right. Now, why? I stopped collecting Black Series. What's the point of collecting Black Series if you're not really, you know, diving into it? Well, I'm only collecting, you know, the... Uh, Mandalorian figures and Ahsoka figures for the mere fact if I'm going to meet the actress so or actor actor or actress I already have somewhere somewhere over here that you can't see um, I already have like four figures black series that are signed um, and I'm going to continue so I know we're going to go meet Natasha uh, Natasha Lubor Dizzo um, we're going to go meet her at Fan Expo Philadelphia because I already paid for my ticket. I already paid for her uh, autograph and table photo. So this is going to happen. It's going to happen. We're going to get this autographed. It's going to be perfect. So that's great to finally pick up. There you have it. That is the hunt. Uh, it was cool to check out the other stores around, you know, driving back home technically throughout New Jersey. But... It is what it is. Uh, I couldn't find anything. I was hoping to find some Street Fighter figures. Didn't happen, but that's all right. And you guys will know why later in, down the next hunt or so. <laughs> so, guys, I hope you had a good time watching the video. I hope, you know, you saw some cool stuff. Very cool vintage stuff in this show. But that is it. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. As always, I appreciate it. Hope to see you soon, and I hope to see you on the next hunt. Thank you.